Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Assalamu alaikum. Today I want to share an important message about myself with everyone. Some people claim and say to me that I'm misleading and misguiding people by using the name of Allah Subhanahu wa Ta'ala and Khatimun Nabiyyin Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam. Some also say that I have made these dreams up, written them myself, and I am trying to make it look like I am Imam Mahdi. Likewise, some people also say that I am a liar and my dreams are not true. Today, I would like to answer these questions for you. I have not used the name of Allah Subhanahu wa Taala and Khatimun Nabiyyin Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam to mislead or misguide people. Nor have I written these dreams up by my own self. I do not want to make it look like I am Imam Mahdi. Nor I have ever claimed to be Imam Mahdi. I'm not even a scholar or a cleric, and I'm a simple, common man. And I do not seek reward from anyone for what I say. Khatimun Nabiyyin, Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam, is the last messenger of Allah, and the mercy of Allah is for everyone. I just want to be a friend of Allah. That is all my intention. My dreams are from Allah Rabbil Alamin, and I have tried my best to narrate them exactly as what I have seen. Only Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala can make these dreams into reality, and I ask for help from Allah only. Allah alone is sufficient for me, and Allah is my wakil. I do not force anyone to believe in these dreams. Everyone has their right to exercise their judgment about this. I'm only sharing these dreams with everyone because I have been instructed by Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala and Khatimun Nabiyyin Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala has told me that Qasim, if anyone calls you a liar, then tell them to join you, and together you both send the curse of Allah upon the liar. And whoever uses the name of Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala and Khatimun Nabiyyin Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. To mislead and misguide people, then they should remain in hellfire forever. Amen.